Welcome to the workout. The format for the workout is pretty straightforward. It'll be three rounds of five movements, and there's one minute of rest included between each round. We'll do one minute of ice skaters, one minute of step ups or high knee drives. This can be done with or without weight. The next is one minute of ground touch with shuffle hop, then one minute of dead bugs. Lastly, we have something a little different. This is reach throughs. This will be in the plank position. You can do that either on your knees or in a full plank position. And you'll reach under and through, working on stabilizing in the plank position, but also working on your rotation. You won't just be doing these reach throughs for the full minute. Instead, you'll do a chest to ground or a drop down after every four reps of the reach throughs. We have fit happy hour athlete Becky leading the workout today. And as always, if you need more information or a refresher on any of the movements, you can check out the demo videos before you get started. Three, two, one, and go. We've got ice skaters. We're gonna be here for a minute. We're really working on the butt, hips, and legs. And the purpose of the movement is to improve your coordination and dynamic balance and to strengthen those lower legs. So be sure to absorb the landing with your entire body and think about making as little sound as possible on the landing. We're trying to jump laterally and not just stepping side to side. So stabilize your balance before taking off again. Nice job, less than 20 seconds left here. And then we have step ups or high knee drives next. Good, five seconds left. Three, two, one, and switch to either step ups or high knee drives. We're trying to work on that single leg balance here. So keep your foot, ankle, and knee in alignment. If you're doing these high knee drives, really take your time. It's natural to feel like you wanna look down, but try to look ahead. Keep your eyes straight ahead and really focus on that balance. Nice job, you've got less than 20 seconds left. We've got ground touch with shovel hop next in three, two, one, and switch. You can keep the arms relaxed as you reach outside of the foot. And when shovel hopping, push off of the outside foot to transfer the movement towards the inside foot. Then you can squat down towards the ground and only squat down as far as your body will let you. We wanna make sure to have a neutral back as you squat down. Great job, keep it up. You have less than 20 seconds left here. We've got dead bugs next in three, two, one, and switch. We can kind of slow down and focus on stabilizing and working those deep core muscles on these dead bugs. And we wanna keep the low back flat against the ground throughout the movement. So only extend as much as you can without the low back coming up off the ground. This doesn't have to be a fast movement, so you can move slowly and really work on stabilizing the spine. Great job, less than 20 seconds left.
We're gonna switch to our last movement for the round in three, two, one, and switch to reach throughs. You're gonna get into your plank position, either in a full plank or on your knees. If you're in that full plank position, it's actually gonna be more of a quad position. So just raising the knees up off the ground. You're gonna go four reach throughs and then drop down. So it's at your own pace. Just work on one, two, three, four, drop down, and then back to the reach throughs. Take your time on these reach throughs. We wanna work that rotation. And on the drop down, it's not a strict push up. It's more like a chest to ground burpee. Great job, you've got less than 10 seconds left, and then we have a full minute of rest before we start the next round. Three, two, one, and rest for one minute. We're gonna start back up at the 11 minute mark, and we're gonna start round two with ice skaters. We're gonna start with ice skaters in two, one, and go. You can take your time on these ice skaters, especially if you're struggling with the balance. So make sure you're shifting your weight entirely from one leg to the other and stabilize before you take off to the other side. Nice job, more than halfway there. Remember to make as little sound as possible on the landing each time. We're gonna switch to step ups or high knee drives in three, two, one and switch. Nice job, really work on the posture on either the step ups or the high knee drives. Making sure that the shoulders are back, the hips are extended at the top of each rep. And think about pulling the rib cage down so the chest isn't straight up in the air. Good, you're halfway. We have ground touch with shuffle hop next in 10 seconds. We're gonna switch in three, two, one, and switch. You don't need to touch the ground, but we want to reach towards the ground as much as possible while keeping a neutral spine. And we want to think about squatting down versus just reaching down with the back. You've got 15 seconds left here, and then we're gonna switch to dead bugs.
We're gonna switch in three, two, one, and switch. We wanna maintain a pelvic tilt to stabilize to keep your low back intact with the ground. That means pulling the belly button in and tucking the tailbone. These dead bugs are intended to help you stabilize those deep core muscles. So if you feel like your low back is coming up off the ground, don't go as low when you extend your leg. Great job, you have less than 30 seconds left here on these dead bugs. We've got the reach throughs next in two, one, and switch. We're gonna do four reach throughs in that quad plank position, and then a drop down on every four reps. Great job, find your pace. We've got 30 seconds left, and then we have a full minute of rest. Here we go, we're gonna close out this round in three, two, one, and rest for one minute. We're gonna start back up at the five minute mark with one minute of ice skaters. We're gonna start in five seconds. Three, two, one, go. Let's finish off these last five minutes of work nice and strong. Good work. You got 30 seconds left here on these ice skaters. We've got step ups or high knee drives next in three, two, one, and switch. We wanna focus in on posture, that hip extension, and balance. Great job, you've got 20 seconds left here.
We're gonna switch to ground touch with shuffle hop in three, two, one, and switch. Let's work on keeping the chest up, even as you reach and squat down towards the ground, making sure that the back stays neutral and pushing off in order to shuffle to the opposite side. Here we go, halfway there. We're gonna switch to dead bugs in three, two, one, switch. This is our final two minutes of the workout. Great job. Remember, we don't have to go fast. We wanna work on stabilizing and coordinating this opposite arm and leg. Less than 10 seconds left. Then we have our reach throughs. We're gonna switch in three, two, one. Switch to reach throughs. With every four reps, you're gonna do a drop down. Let's work on taking our time on the reach throughs and doing a quick drop down and getting back into that quad plank position. Nice job, let's finish strong here. We've got less than 30 seconds to go. We're gonna finish up in five, three, two, one, and time. Great job. It's time to cool down, stretch, and hydrate. See you next time.